Swimming World TV here with Lottie Fries. Just finished the 1500, which is your first race of this Grand Prix in Santa Clara. How did it feel for you today, 16 00? Uh, I was quite surprised. I hadn't really. Why are you surprised? Uh, I mean, we just come off camp, like we landed yesterday from Colorado Springs, uh, three weeks uh, high altitude camp. So <laughs> I'm pretty tired, so I'm really surprised and happy with that time. Happy with the time. What do you think you were going to be around coming off of high altitude training? I mean, I was hoping to be around what I did in, in Charlotte, which was 1607. Uh, so it's, I'm, I'm so surprised and, and happy. It's an uh, in-season best, so I couldn't be more satisfied. All right, you were out there in front of the field from the get-go. So you really swam the race all by yourself. So now that you know you went 16 minutes, which is faster than what you thought, did it feel like a 16-minute swim? Uh, yeah. I mean, during the race, I, I could kind of figure out that uh, I was doing great, and it felt pretty, pretty good. Uh, so it felt like a 16-minute race. <laughs> okay, let's talk about that training camp. You just came off uh, from Colorado Springs with mm. North Baltimore. Three weeks there. It's a lot of time to do high altitude. What were some main focuses for you there? Um, I mean, I just think for all of us, it was like to put in the work uh, to get ready for this summer. Uh, the American swimmers, of course, getting ready for the trials, uh, and me and, and the other European swimmers ready for, for Europeans. Uh, so I think that was just the main focus, trying to get ready and get some good work in. What type of yardage are you guys doing for those three weeks? Uh, I mean, this camp was a little bit different because we had like, our, our sessions were like, we had triples one day and then triples the next and then double. And that's how we kept continued on. So I mean, some was six, some was seven, and we had some on five. Um, so it was, it was a little bit of a mix of everything. <laughs> You're relatively new to North Baltimore still. So, how is this training different than what you've done in the past? What's the biggest difference now swimming under Bob? I mean, the biggest difference is by far that the American swimmers come into every practice and is ready to work, work really hard and want to work really hard because their their way, or the way they have to go to international meet is like competing against their like countrymen. The yeah, so they have to work really hard to, just to get on an international team and go to the Worlds and go to Pan Packs and go to the Olympics. Uh, so they have to work very hard every single day. Not that I don't, maybe if I was in Denmark, but they work very, very hard and they motivate me to work. Yeah, push very, you very forward. Yeah. So looking at the Americans, now that you're training with them and the distance American that you have to keep your eye on in the mm -hmm. long run in 16 is going to be Katie Ledecky. Now, yeah. have you heard yet that she just swam the 1500? and how her oh. went. So right after you swam, Katie <laughs> swam, she broke her world record. Oh, really? That's yeah. good. And how, do, how are you able to use that to move you forward in the looking forward to Rio 2016 beyond the European Championships? Because as you said, the Americans, that's what's helping push you forward. Uh, I mean, Katie is, is, of course, one of my main competitors. Um, I always try to think, if I have a really hard set, to think about them during practice and things that they are do, putting in the work and I have to. Uh, so, I mean, she's still young. Uh, she has a little bit more energy and recover a little bit more faster than me, so I have to make it up in some other, part, uh, other points of my training and other way uh, of doing stuff. So, that's how I try and, and do it. So, in preparing for the championship meets this, this year, what, is, what are some of the main things that you want to improve? Where do you need uh, my to turns? Uh, I've been working a lot on with with the coaches in North Baltimore, um, and then I just just I think just getting in some more speed uh, and trying to hold it throughout the race. Thank you. Good luck the rest of this weekend. Thank you.